so let's get a conversation here before we get too too deep in the weeds this evening. There's a couple things that happened yesterday that I want to talk about. And I, for anybody out there, let me just give you a little, for any women out there, I'm going to just make a video on this for me too as well before we get too far into weeds. I've been informed that for, if you're you may be living live in the world right now, at least in the state, there is a lot of, I'm sure some of y'all know what this is, sex trafficking. I'm sure y'all know what that is. If you're a female or you have kids, listen closely, okay? Especially if you live in the States. I don't know anywhere else in the world, but if you live in the States, listen closely. If you have kids or you are a woman, when you go out to your car, check your passenger side door before you get into your vehicle. Because sex traffickers are what they're doing is tagging people's vehicles. And with the way they tag their vehicles now, they have these little tiny zip ties, black zip ties. You find a black zip tie on your door, on your passenger side door of your vehicle. Call the cop, get indoors where you'll be safe quickly. I would say get in your vehicle quickly, but by then it might already, they might already be moving. So, if you have kids or you're a woman and you have a zip tie attached to your passenger side doors, get inside, get to the police as soon as possible. Apparently that's been a thing of lately. My agency is going to close down a bunch of places because of human trafficking. Yeah, if you are not comfortable, carry safe, uh, you know, safety arms of some sorts. Pepper spray is legal across the state, depending on where you are, depending on what size it may be. And if you're legal certain states, a gun is a good way of equalizing the bastard. Be wary, be warned, it is a bit of a, on a rise of lately. And I hate to say that, it's a... It's a bad thing. I everybody be safe. Everybody be careful. And uh, if you do know somebody that lives in the states and you you, wor you are worried about their safety and you think they possibly could be uh, getting targeted, please stay vigilant and pay attention. Okay, so I'm pretty sure most of y'all know who this lady is. If you are on Twitch or anywhere online, you should know who the heck this woman is. This is Pokemon now. While I do not like some of the things yeah. Pokemon has done in the past, oh, no. this is going to be a topic that I want people also to be wary of. If you are a female streamer, yeah. you're anybody. Pokey, pokey. Be wary. Um, now, this is not something Pokey did. This is something that happened to her. And this is a part of a PSA or whatever you want to call it to make sure people are aware I have dealt with sponsors before. And being that I'm a guy, I really doubt this is going to happen. But if they wanted to try it with me, I wouldn't be as nearly as worrisome unless they want me to show other parts of my body. But let's get into this real fast. This is Pokemane again. And I'm pretty sure y'all can hear, but listen to what she has to say. This is kind of wild. Mainly because I don't want anyone else to fall for this really weird influencer scam. It all started a couple weeks ago. I don't know why she just edited it right there. A company called Neiwai. If you don't know, they make like Set. loungewear, bras. Those and tea, she own esports. And I actually mentioned them in one of my I think she's videos, a partner or at least a partial and owner of one. And sometimes when you order from a company and you talk about them, since they have your email from the order that you made, they'll email you and just say like, oh, thank you for the shout out. And they asked me if I wanted some PR, which like if you use the stuff, why not, right? So afterwards, they sent me like this PowerPoint of this new collection that they want to launch, and they said that. Okay, so for everybody to understand, she's she she's she loves a certain product, and then when you love a certain product, you know we want to talk about them, right? Even even if you're not sponsored by them, you want to talk about them because you are you're interested in that product. Your viewers are going to hear about that product, um, and being that you are a big name, there's a good chance that people that that make the product is going to hear about you talking about their product because well you are free advertising in a lot of ways and they either want to they're cool they want to give it back to you for free advertisement or two they want to work with you because then they find that you love their stuff and they want to work and see get you more involved with them so that's what happens here she she talked about a product that she wears and she loves and the creators of the product has not gotten in touch with her that they just need my measurements and my address and that they'll send me like three custom bras whatever however i was in new york at the time so i said hey can i send you all this stuff in a week when i'm back home and they said yeah that's totally fine 
They follow up a few days later when I'm back in LA and I go to take my measurements and that's when I look at the email with the diagram they sent me and everything and I realize that they weren't showing me how to take my measurements. They were asking me to put tape measure around me and send them a photo of my bare chest. Okay, so for those who are, let's say, not aware of this or never done this before in your life, let's say you're a guy, most likely you don't know what she's very much talking about. Measurements and measurements. What's the difference? There is a difference. Okay, so we got American measurements and then we got, let's say, like Japan measurements. They're the totally different things. Their size of small is like our size and freaking anorexic, you need to go eat girl kind of measurements. They're totally different. So she doesn't know how they want her to measure and what is like to what, let's say to them is a, a G or a B or whatever. I don't know what Pokemon size is. Might be to them, might be a, a might be an F or a Z. I don't, it's a different measurement size with them to her. They, so she needs to know that so she can tell them, okay, I am a, I am a BB or, or I'm a double D or whatever, right? But to them, it might be double D is a double F. I don't really know. Again, I don't know the measurements. But it, it might be American measurements. It might be different. But no, they want her to just take off her clothes and wrap it around her and take a picture of herself. That immediately sends off red warning to what is going on here. No company is going to ask you to send them a photo of your yiddies. So that's when I realized this whole time I've been speaking to a scammer. They made a fake email pretending to be working at the company and they added the same ending that the company would use, but then they put at hotmail.com, but they were also forwarding me fake emails from their fake boss, obviously just editing to pretend like it's a legit company email. Yeah, this guy who this person was had dedication. They were, they were there to work it. They made a fake multi-page PowerPoint. And this person had kindly followed up numerous times. The amount of effort they put in is both comical and frightening. I don't even want to think about what they would have done if I actually sent them anything. Whether it's extort me for money, blackmail me. Like, if they have my address, it's even worse. That's also why you should always send stuff to a P.O. box. Do not give companies your actual address. Okay, so that very last statement right there, I get the po whole P.O. box. You don't want to give someone your actual address. You might also, if you're someone like Pokemon, you should be going through a separate company to help you connect yourself with, with the sponsors. Like, hey, you want to get in touch with me? Get in touch with my with my legal side of things or people that deal with that kind of stuff to make sure you're legit. Like, you know, to run you through. Not just, let's have direct co contact with each other. I know Pokemon is supposed to be like, you know, a, a boss or whatever. I would have someone do some checks beforehand. Just to make sure they're legit. I don't, um, call me paranoid, because I am. I don't trust a lot of people. And that kind of stuff, like, I go I go through a, another company with my sponsor, so that's why I know it's 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 a little bit more legit. But if they get something in, in legit, well, they had to pay for it because they, they got the false information or false stuff, so they had to pay for their mistake and pay me out, whatever. Most of, so far, no sponsors have been legit, so, so I guess like, it's pretty good, right? For her, I would have some of the logistic people to take care of that and make sure they get in touch with the people directly to make sure there's not some other scam. Maybe contact the company and email and say, hey, I got contacted by this person, this person. Is, is this person work with y'all? Something like that. But um, if they would have got a picture of her with her ditties and a tape measure around her, oh, you best believe that would have been all over the internet. Or they would have used it for blackmail, which could have been very, very much the case. I not see no one going to contact me for using no boxers and having me measure my hips and my cat and trying to measure around going, all right, I am and showing all my, my Johnson and Biddies. That is, that's pretty scary. So again, if you're a woman out there and you are looking to get in sponsors, be careful. Because a lot of beauty products and a lot of uh, clothing lines, they're not always that interested in streamers. Let's just be real here. But if you have a big name like Pokemon, I guess you can maybe get a little bit more uh, of diversity going on with you. Be happy. In every life we have some trouble But when you worry you make it double Don't worry Be happy Don't worry
Ah, 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 ah,